When you start the engine without a radiator cap, and notice that the coolant is being pushed out, even after changing the head gasket, it can be quite perplexing. Here are some possible reasons for this issue. Air pockets in the cooling system. One common cause is the presence of air pockets in the cooling system. When you change the head gasket, it often introduces air into the system. These air pockets can cause a blockage, preventing the coolant from circulating properly and leading to a buildup of pressure that forces the coolant out. To address this, you need to bleed the coolant system thoroughly. 1. Turn on the heater. Start the engine and turn the heater to max. This helps circulate the coolant fully through the heater core and helps release trapped air. 2. Bleeder valves. Use any bleeder valves on the engine to release trapped air. These are often located near the thermostat or on the upper radiator hose. 3. Proper filling. Fill the radiator slowly while periodically squeezing the upper radiator hose to help push air out, pressure building up in the system. Another possible reason is unwanted pressure building up in the system, which could indicate a more serious issue. 1. Faulty head gasket. Even after replacement, if the head gasket was not installed correctly, or if the head itself is warped or cracked, it could result in combustion gases entering the cooling system. You might need to check for a proper seal or test for leaks using a chemical test kit. 2. Water pump issue. A malfunctioning water pump may not be circulating coolant effectively, causing it to pool and build pressure. Radiator blockage. A blockage in the radiator can also cause coolant to be pushed out due to increased pressure. 1. Radiator flush. Perform a radiator flush to ensure there are no blockages in the cooling fins or cores. 2. Check for obstructions. Sometimes debris or rust can partially block the coolant passages, requiring a more thorough inspection or replacement of the radiator. Thermostat malfunction. A stuck or incorrectly installed thermostat can cause overheating and pressure buildup. 1. Thermostat. Check. Ensure the thermostat is opening and closing properly. You can test it by placing it in a pot of boiling water and seeing if it opens. 2. Correct installation. Ensure that it's installed in the right orientation. Takeaway. Addressing this issue involves a bit of detective work. Start by bleeding the cooling system to remove air pockets. If that doesn't work, check for deeper issues such as a faulty head gasket, a malfunctioning water pump, or a blockage in the radiator. Safety is paramount, so make sure the engine is cool before opening the radiator cap again. If all else fails, consider seeking professional help to diagnose and fix the issue properly. If you're ever in the Pacific Northwest, there are some great mechanics in Portland, Oregon who could help. Stay safe and good luck with your car maintenance. Scott